What's going on guys, it's Apple Critics, and in this video I'll be showing you all the new and great features of iOS 6. So, if I go into Settings, General, About, you will see that I'm on iOS 6. Now, iOS 6 has many new features, and in this video I'll be giving you a rundown. So, the first one is the Music app. So if you go into the music app, you can see that the volume slider is different along with the uh, custom music controls, uh, and it's slightly skinned and redesigned. Now if you go into the main menu, you can see that it's uh, different and it's in white instead, and you still have that cover flow feature as well. If you go into the phone app, you will see that the dialer is much different and it's in white instead. If you go into the app store, you will see that it is skinned in black uh, and the presentation of the applications is much different. Now if you look in the weather app, you can see that it's slightly different it is skinned with the whole iOS 6 feed. Once you go into settings, you will see that the settings app is completely redesigned with all the settings panels. You have the Bluetooth, you have the carrier, do not disturb, uh, you also have the notifications, so if you turn do not disturb mode on, you'll still get your messages and everything and all those notifications, but your device won't vibrate or it won't uh, light up. Now if you look at the settings panels, you'll see that brightness and wallpaper are together and it's much like the iPad. Now if you go into general, Siri, you'll see that Siri has support for many languages. Now Siri is finally branching off to more languages. So if we go ahead and try out Siri. What is the score for the Miami Heat game? The Heat defeated the Celtics by a score of 101-88 to last Saturday. Celtics are out of the playoffs. You will see that it gives you a very brief description and it explains everything about the game uh, and it's a scoreboard in Siri. What movies are Adam Sandler in? Okay, I found some movies starring Adam Sandler. So I can ask Siri about some actors and it will show me all the movies that they're in. Now Siri has been updated uh, and it is a welcome addition to iOS 6. If I go into photos and then click on the share button, you can see that it's redesigned and it shows the icons instead of just the plain old text. Passbook is a new app on iOS 6. You'll see that Passbook is for the stuff in your pocket so you can have your boarding passes, tickets, uh, store cards, coupons, all in one app, and it's very easy to manage, and it's much like Google Wallet, but Apple's version, and much better. Also, on iOS 6, calling has been improved, so if I get an incoming call, you will see that I have the options to decline or accept, and if I slide this up, I have the options to reply with a message or remind me later. So if I click on reply with message, I have the options of I'll call you later, I'm on my way, what's up, or custom. And I also have the option of remind me later. So I can say in one hour or when I leave. Now the Maps app is redesigned and it doesn't use Google Apps anymore. It uses Apple's own map system. So you can see it's in 3D and you can see all the buildings and landscapes around a certain location that you choose. And you can see that you can enable the 3D feature and if you swipe the page up, you can see that you can show traffic if you decide to. And you have the option of hybrid, satellite, list results, drop pin, and print. So that is Maps on iOS 6. Now if you want to get iOS 6, visit iOSbetas.com. And you will have to pay $10 just to get iOS 6 and all the future betas. And that is a one-time only fee. And that is much better than paying $100 for iOS 6. So those are all the new and great features of iOS 6. Please be sure to subscribe and like this video. Please follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash applecritics. I reply to me for any tech-related questions. I'll be sure to answer them. And feel free to like my Facebook fan page and drop a comment down below. Thanks for watching.